Earlier this month, Audrey Roloff expressed her consternation over a milestone. A love letter life turns two today. She wrote an Instagram of the book she and husband Jeremy released in the spring of 2019, adding, I was reminded today of how grateful I am for the opportunity to have written a New York Times best-selling book with the love of my life, and to be able to meet thousands of you who read it and were impacted in some way. What a complete honor. This past December, meanwhile, Audrey announced the release of a second memoir. This book is full of creative ideas, questions and challenges with the hope of helping you build a fun, fulfilling and forever love, Audrey wrote online of creative love, saying at the time. We're calling it a snack book and hope it's something that can live on your nightstand or coffee table, something that you refer back to and look and flip to certain chapters for ideas, jolts of inspiration and meaningful conversation starters. The thing is, Audrey's announcement was not exactly met with a round of applause. Quite the contrary, actually, as a number of social media users took Audrey to test for coming across like a pompous know-it-all. What makes you such a love expert? These critics asked. Must you continue to monetize your relationship? Others inquired. Now, in the face of such criticism, Audrey says she won't be coming out with another book. When are you going to write that always more book? I'm ready to pre-order it," one follower recently asked as a part of a social media Q&A session. Rolla didn't cite any of the insults that have come her way in response, but she did make this confession. You're probably not gonna like this response, but I actually backed out of writing that book. We were under contract for three books with our publisher before we had kids. After starting to write the second, we realized we needed to get out of writing the third. The former reality star added the couple had the hope to write more books down the road in a different season of life. Will this actually happen? Maybe. But the admission came after Audrey was trashed for running her marriage like a business by trolls in her Instagram account. Have you ever thought about your marriage having a greater purpose beyond itself? She asked a negative commenter who made the business remark earlier. Greater purpose like profit and profit? No, this person replied. No, not like profiting off it, Audrey shot back. And that was that for that exchange. But it does now sound as if Audrey is realizing that people aren't exactly anxious to hear from her. Not when she goes around spreading dangerous medical information. And not when she gets so worked up about her husband watching adult movies. And definitely not when she says gay marriage is a sin. That's it for now, thank you for watching. Please subscribe to stay tuned.